Are you ready to master the art of not caring and letting go? Stoicism has been around for centuries, and it has a lot to offer when it comes to mastering the art of letting go and not caring. The seven Stoic principles are key to achieving this mindset and mastering the art of not caring. Lesson 1. Focus on the present moment. Living in the present moment is akin to savoring the finest delicacy. It's the essence of mindfulness, a state where our attention is wholly immersed in the now. We find ourselves shackled by the burdens of yesterday or consumed by the uncertainties of tomorrow. Stoicism gently nudges us to release these chains and anchor ourselves in the beauty of the present. It's in this moment that we possess the power to shape our thoughts, actions, and emotions. Consider the marvels that surround us, the gentle caress of the wind, the symphony of birdsong, the vibrant hues of nature's canvas. These wonders unfold in the present, inviting us to revel in their splendor. By embracing the now, we free ourselves from the regrets of the past and the anxieties of the future. Focusing on the present cultivates a profound sense of awareness. It allows us to immerse ourselves entirely in our endeavors, be it work, relationships, or personal growth. When our attention is undivided, our actions become purposeful and our experiences more enriching. This principle is not a mere abstract concept, it's a practice, an art to be honed. Through mindfulness exercises, meditation, or even the simple act of conscious breathing, we train ourselves to reside in the present. Stoicism reminds us that life is a series of moments, and it's in each fleeting moment that the essence of our existence unfolds. By focusing on the present, we infuse our lives with intentionality and meaning. We grant ourselves the gift of true presence, the ability to fully engage with the richness of life as it unfolds before us. Let each passing moment be a canvas upon which you paint your aspirations, your joys, and your authenticity. For in the present lies the gateway to a life brimming with fulfillment and purpose. Lesson 2. Accept the things you cannot control. Embracing the tenet of accepting the things beyond our control is akin to finding serenity in the midst of life's tumultuous currents. Stoicism beckons us to acknowledge the boundaries of our influence and to gracefully accept the realities that lie beyond our grasp. Life, in its intricate tapestry, weaves together circumstances, events, and the actions of others, variables over which we wield no dominion. Attempting to alter these uncontrollable elements only begets inner turmoil and frustration. Thus, Stoicism advises us to release the illusion of control and instead focus on our response to these external forces. Imagine a sculptor fashioning a masterpiece from marble. They carve and mold the stone, embracing its natural contours rather than fighting against them. Similarly, accepting the uncontrollable facets of life allows us to adapt and respond with resilience. This principle does not advocate passivity. Rather, it empowers us to direct our energies towards what lies within our sphere of influence, our thoughts, choices, and attitudes. By relinquishing the futile pursuit of changing the unchangeable, we liberate ourselves from the shackles of distress, finding solace in the wisdom of surrender. Acceptance does not imply resignation. It signifies a shift in perspective, a conscious choice to cease wrestling with the unalterable and instead redirect our focus towards fostering inner peace. It's through this acceptance that we unveil the true essence of freedom a freedom rooted in our ability to choose our responses despite the circumstances. Stoicism urges us to embrace this principle as a guiding light, allowing us to navigate the unpredictable currents of life with grace and resilience. By accepting the things beyond our control, we forge an unshakable foundation of inner tranquility, empowering us to tread the path of life with unwavering equanimity. Lesson 3. Cultivate self-awareness. Cultivating self-awareness is akin to navigating the labyrinth of our inner selves, unveiling the depths of our thoughts, emotions, and actions. Stoicism extols the virtues of self-examination, encouraging us to embark on a profound journey of introspection. 
At its core, self-awareness is the mirror reflecting our true essence. It bestows upon us the invaluable gift of understanding, the ability to discern our strengths, weaknesses, desires, and motivations. Through this introspective lens, we gain insights into our patterns of behavior, allowing us to chart a course towards self-improvement. Stoicism invites us to pause amidst life's whirlwind and turn our gaze inward. It prompts us to question our beliefs, challenge our assumptions, and observe our reactions to external stimuli. In doing so, we become architects of our own growth, consciously molding our character and virtues. Practicing self-awareness is not merely an exercise in observation. It's an act of self-compassion, a gesture of acknowledging our humanity. By understanding ourselves more deeply, we foster empathy towards others, recognizing the shared human experience in all its intricacies. Self-awareness serves as a compass guiding us towards authenticity. It aligns our actions with our values and aspirations, fostering congruence between our inner convictions and outward demeanor. Through this alignment, we pave the way for a more harmonious and fulfilling existence. Self-awareness stands as a cornerstone, a foundational pillar upon which the edifice of wisdom and virtue is constructed. Embrace this practice of self-reflection, not as an arduous task, but as a voyage of self-discovery, an odyssey that unravels the intricacies of your being and empowers you to transcend towards your highest potential. For in the depths of self-awareness lies the key to unlocking the doors to personal transformation and profound self-mastery. Lesson 4. Practice indifference to external outcomes. Practicing indifference to external outcomes is an art of detachment, a deliberate embrace of a mindset that transcends the fixation on results beyond our control. Stoicism teaches us to shift our focus from fixating on the end results to investing our energies in the process itself. In life's grand theater, there exists a myriad of variables that lie outside the realm of our influence. Careers, relationships, and endeavors of various kinds are subject to the unpredictable whims of fate and external circumstances. Stoicism advises us to detach ourselves from the allure of these outcomes and instead channel our efforts towards our actions and intentions. Consider the analogy of a farmer tending to the fields. They diligently sow the seeds, nurture the crops, and tend to the land, yet they cannot command the rains or control the seasons. Similarly, while we exert our efforts and diligence, the outcomes remain at the mercy of the unpredictable tides of life. By adopting indifference to external outcomes, we liberate ourselves from the chains of expectation and attachment. This doesn't imply apathy or lack of ambition. Rather, it encourages a shift in perspective, an acknowledgement that our duty lies in the conscientious execution of our endeavors, not in the guarantee of specific results. The Stoic philosophy champions the notion that our virtue and fulfillment stem from the purity of our intentions and the integrity of our actions irrespective of external rewards or recognition. This detachment from outcomes allows us to embrace resilience in the face of success or failure, fostering a sense of inner peace rooted in our unwavering commitment to our principles. Let us strive, like the Stoics of old, to immerse ourselves fully in the pursuit of our goals while embracing the uncertainty of outcomes. By practicing indifference to external results, we fortify our resilience, nurture our integrity, and pave the path to a tranquil existence, one liberated from the capricious sway of external forces. Lesson 5. Embrace hardship as an opportunity. Embracing hardship as an opportunity is a testament to the resilience and transformative power inherent in the Stoic philosophy. Rather than viewing adversity as a stumbling block, Stoicism invites us to perceive it as a stepping stone towards growth and self-improvement. Life, with its unpredictable twists and turns, often presents us with challenges, setbacks, and trials. Instead of recoiling from these adversities, Stoicism encourages us to greet them as allies on our journey towards personal development. Picture a blacksmith fashioning a piece of iron into a formidable tool. 
The raw material undergoes intense heat and relentless hammering, transforming into a resilient instrument capable of withstanding great pressures. Similarly, hardships, when embraced with stoic resolve, mold our character, fortify our resilience, and hone our virtues. By reframing our perspective, we discern the hidden opportunities nestled within adversity. Challenges serve as catalysts for growth, unveiling our inner strengths and nurturing resilience. They provide fertile ground for learning, fostering adaptability, and imparting invaluable lessons that propel us towards self-mastery. Embracing hardship fosters a shift in mindset, a paradigm where difficulties are viewed not as impediments, but as avenues for self-discovery and refinement. It's amidst the trials that our true metal is tested, and our capacity for growth is unearthed. Stoicism beckons us to embrace these hardships not with despair, but with an unwavering spirit. A spirit that recognizes adversities as invitations to evolve, transform, and emerge stronger. By welcoming challenges as opportunities for growth, we transcend the constraints of comfort zones, embarking on a journey towards profound self-realization. Hardship is not an adversary to be feared, but an esteemed mentor guiding us towards the pinnacle of our potential. Embrace these challenges as invitations for growth, for it is through overcoming adversity that we forge the steel of our character and stride towards a life brimming with resilience and wisdom. Lesson 6. Separate Opinions from Facts Separating opinions from facts is a cornerstone of stoic wisdom, guiding us to navigate the labyrinth of perspectives that color our perceptions of the world. Stoicism encourages us to discern between the subjective interpretations we hold and the objective truths that exist beyond our biases. In the mosaic of existence, our minds often weave intricate narratives colored by our beliefs, experiences, and biases. These narratives, while shaping our understanding of reality, can sometimes cloud our judgment, blurring the lines between what is factual and what is a mere interpretation. Consider a landscape painted by different observers. Each sees it through a unique lens, coloring their perception with personal experiences and beliefs. Stoicism implores us to acknowledge the subjectivity of these perceptions, urging us to seek clarity by differentiating between opinions shaped by individual perspectives and objective realities. By cultivating this discernment, we unveil a path to clarity and objectivity. We learn to pause and evaluate our thoughts, questioning their origins and validity. Stoicism encourages us to subject our beliefs to rigorous scrutiny, allowing us to distinguish between what we perceive and what truly exists. This practice liberates us from the bondage of undue influence, be it from societal norms, others' opinions, or our own biases. It empowers us to embrace a more reasoned and impartial view of the world fostering a mindset that rests upon a foundation of objectivity rather than subjective interpretations. Separating opinions from facts is not a dismissal of perspectives, but a quest for truth, a commitment to engaging with the world in a manner that transcends personal biases. By honing this discernment, we cultivate a clarity of thought that enables us to navigate life's complexities with wisdom, objectivity, and a deeper understanding of reality. Lesson 7. Practice Self-Reflection and Gratitude Practicing self-reflection and gratitude is akin to nurturing the soil from which the seeds of contentment and inner peace flourish. Stoicism advocates these practices as fundamental pillars for fostering a profound connection with oneself and the world around us. Self-reflection beckons us to journey inward, to pause amidst life's hustle and bustle, and delve into the recesses of our thoughts, emotions, and experiences. It's a deliberate act of introspection, a moment of stillness where we examine our actions, motivations, and aspirations. Through this introspective lens, we gain insights into our strengths, weaknesses, and areas for growth. Stoicism encourages us to embrace self-reflection, not as a tool for self-criticism, but as a means of self-improvement. It allows us to celebrate our triumphs, 
learn from our failures, and chart a course towards personal evolution and fulfillment. Intertwined with self-reflection is the practice of gratitude, a profound acknowledgement of the blessings woven into the fabric of our lives. Gratitude is a prism through which we perceive the beauty and abundance that surround us, transcending moments of scarcity or adversity. When we cultivate gratitude, we shift our focus from what's lacking to the abundance that graces our lives. A smile from a loved one, the warmth of the sun on a chilly day, or the simple pleasures of existence. Stoicism teaches us to savor these moments, embracing gratitude as a cornerstone of a fulfilling life. By intertwining self-reflection with gratitude, we cultivate a state of mindfulness, a profound awareness of the richness that envelops us. These practices ground us in the present, fostering contentment and serenity irrespective of life's fluctuations. Self-reflection and gratitude are not fleeting moments, but lifelong companions, guiding us towards a life brimming with fulfillment, authenticity, and an unwavering appreciation for the marvels that grace our existence. As we embark on this journey of self-discovery and gratitude, we unravel the beauty of life's intricacies, nurturing a sense of profound contentment and inner peace.